Hey guys, it's the one and only Bougie Marie. And your boy Jay. Today we're reacting to SLM movie Jeffy's I'm supposed Pregnancy to my eyebrows. School. Oh, yeah, I can see. Like, do you see how this one look good? Yeah. And then you can't really tell, like, you're really up close, but like. I can tell. You fucked it up. <laughs> I mean, at least I got glasses because you can't really see. Yeah. But yeah, if I had it. I mean, it don't look that bad, but yeah, it, it looks bad. Like, this left one, the left one is given. Uh, see, it, it, it usually be the right one that's given and the left one get proper. But today, the left one is given and then it's, I just missed, you know what? It don't matter. It don't but, matter. Because uh, my girlfriend told me I said it looked good. That's all that matters. I have to fix it for you. No. Uh, mm -mm. I got the clippers. I don't use clippers. I used a face razor to do them. I used to go get them, I used to go get them wax, but since I know how to do them, I just get them. But. Yeah, I was low key rushing, so yeah. Mm -hmm. Probably would have took my time. Still would have fucked up, but yeah. Before we get to this, make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe. Oh, no. You should let me wax you. No. You should let me wax you, <laughs> bro. If I, you wax me. You could. If I wax you, you could wax me. No. You could wax her armpits. Oh yeah, you need to wax them because last week, oh my god, it was like a, was like a bush. Like, it, was it was not because we could really run it. Like we could. Mini, I could really go back. Like a mini like, fro. That's mm -hmm. nothing compared to what I had to endure at basic. They did not let us. Sh Whew, we ain't gonna talk about that, but yeah. They didn't let y'all shave. During red, during yellow and red face, we was not allowed to shave, and that was that was Are a we? month. Uh, we wasn't allowed to shave for a month. Uh, as soon as white face came, literally that white face was. We went to the woods on Friday, mm -hmm. slept just the night. Saturday, mm -hmm. went back to the station, and on Sunday, we was able to shave. Literally, everybody was in that shower shaving. But, um, yeah, before we get to the video, make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe, turn on the post notifications, and get straight into the video. Why you dumb? Oh my crap! Today, we're gonna be doing another show and tell. So, hopefully, you brought something cool to show the class. What'd you bring for show and tell, Cody? I brought my violin. I learned how to play Star Wars on it. That's so cool. What'd you bring, Joseph? I brought a watch. What, Joseph? Why would you bring a watch? Why wouldn't I, I bring a watch, watch Cody? What if it stings you? It's not gonna sting me. It's my pet. Duh. It's not I your pet. The wise ring. And I was gonna be at my house. Oh my gosh. I had to... We could just swing back and go get him. I can because I think I still have time before I got a waiter. In this cup, huh? Well, because you trapped it in there? Guys, look what I brought for show and tell. I brought a never before opened Hey Arnold toy. Oh, dude, that's super cool. Yeah, I guess that's kind of cool. You know how hard it is not to open up a Hey Arnold toy for years, Cody? Not, not that hard. What'd you bring, Penelope? I brought my Princess Piggy Baby. Did you watch Hey Arnold as a kid? Yeah. Did you like it? Yeah, it's cool. I didn't really like it. I wasn't a Hey Arnold type of girl. That was cool. Well, I'll give you my Hey Arnold toy for the forty-five dollars. No, Junior. Oh, I'm so mad at Penelope for not giving me that money. All right, Debbie, you can go still and show and tell first. Booga, 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 booga. Don't be scared. Mm, nah. Yeah, I found. Very scary, Debbie. You can go back to your seat. All right, Penelope, it's your turn. I can't wait to show everyone my piggy bank. Okay, everybody, I'm gonna be playing the intro song from Star Wars. You know, the one that goes like, da na 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 you know, you know that one? Okay, here we go. Wait, did he say screaming? Are you kidding me? 
Okay. He enjoys my beautiful music. He didn't say screaming. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I thought it was trivia. He's not stunned by a wasp and I'm allergic. Now my stomach's all bloated. Well, maybe you're pregnant, Penelope. Shut up, Junior. Maybe Jeffy got you pregnant when he ran into you. <gasps> I got Penelope pregnant? Hey, Daddy. What's wrong, Jeffy? Did your classmates not like your lion mask? No, they did. Then why the long face? Because my mommy drank when she was pregnant with me. No, I meant why are you sad? <laughs> I'm afraid to tell you. Jeffy, we're your parents. You can tell us anything. Yeah, Jeffy. You promise yeah, that favorite line. You well, can tell me anything. First. And you promise to take me to Disney World so I can get over it? How bad is it, Jeffy? Oh, it's really bad. Like, so bad. Like, the worst thing ever. My life is over. Did you kill someone? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, she gets to make that decision later on down the line. No, yeah. her her choice. <laughs> what are you talking about, Jimmy? I got a girl pregnant. <laughs> you got a girl pregnant, Jimmy? Why would you do that? Well, hey, it's not my fault. Oh, it is your fault, Jimmy. You're the one who did it. Well, I ran into her and I busted her pink piggy open and then she asked me to pay for it. She asked you to pay for it? Yeah. Oh, my God, baby, Jimmy, I caught up in some weird money situation. <laughs> baby, Jimmy, are you sure she's pregnant? Yeah, her belly's already big. Well, Jimmy, why didn't you tell us sooner? Well, I just found out today. Oh, my God, are you sure it's yours? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I did bust that pink piggy wide open, Daddy. I did make a mess. It was all over the garbage. <laughs> oh, Jeffy! Well, why did you even do this at Jimmy? In your classroom. Oh, Jimmy, you're sick. You are sick, Jimmy. Why would you do that? Why well, was an accident. I hope it was an accident. I hope you didn't plan on doing this, Jeffy. Well, yeah, it was the first time I ran into her. Oh, my God, Jeffy, you're supposed to get the nose on before you do that. Oh, my God, baby, what do we do? We need to call a doctor. Well, there's always plan B. Jeffy, it's too late for that. Her belly's already big. Well, plan B as in push her down the stairs. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> Jimmy's too young to have a kid. He can't raise a kid. Marvin! Okay, fine. We'll call a doctor and ask him what stairs he recommends pushing her down. Hey, there, somebody call a doctor? <laughs> yeah, doctor, we're not doing so good. <laughs> yeah, me neither, man. This economy, am I right? Ugh, I am barely scraping by. I don't even... My favorite thing to do, crush it up, put it in a spray. Yes, sir. I don't even know if I can afford to keep the lights on next month. My panic attacks keep me up at night. No, I'm talking about Jeffy got someone pregnant. Oh, congratulations. Is it a boy or a girl? I got a girl pregnant. But no, I mean, is the baby a boy or a girl? We don't know yet. We'll let it decide when it gets older. But hopefully it identifies as dead soon. But, okay, so what do you need me for? Listen, doctor, he got a girl pregnant and he hasn't told us who she is yet, but we're just scared. What do we do? Well, Sasquatch probably went back into the woods. What? Well, I mean, no offense to Jeffy, but she had to be pretty hideous if she was willing to bang him. I mean, my daughter would never. She's a straight a student and she has respect for herself. I yes, bet you that's the dad. Well, I'd probably kill her. Strangle her, actually. Yeah, you know, hold her underwater in the bathtub. I for bet you that's the dad. Most likely is. About three minutes? That ought to do it. Yeah. But I don't have to worry about that because she is perfect. Actually, I don't even think she likes boys. Between me and you, I think she prefers runch and mug, if you know what I mean. Well, listen, we just don't know what to do. We've never dealt with a situation like this before. Well, I would suggest calling her over here and having her take a pregnancy test to see if she's even pregnant. I don't want to ask a girl to take a pregnancy test. That's weird. Yeah, we wouldn't want that. How about this? How about I I hide behind the couch and you call her over and then when she gets here I jump out and scare her so she pees a little bit because I'm pretty scary and then I'll catch some of that pee with a pregnancy test and then we'll know if she's pregnant or not. You're not scary. Yeah, I guess you're right. I'm not really the best. Ha! See? And we'll get some dirt real quick. Love one thing is another. <laughs> you want to leave my thoughts? Oh yeah, somebody else alright. Nice little nap. <laughs> okay. Don't sleep in here ever again. Right. Hello, right back into it. I can see you. Oh. I was <laughs> hoping that you didn't need to move over here. See, I'm scared. You jumped. Yeah, you are pretty scary. I like your plan more than just asking her to take a pregnancy test. Yeah. Well, we already know she's pregnant because her belly is big. Listen, I'm sure she's f***ing huge. That doesn't mean she's pregnant. You know, Ogus can get pretty big. I mean, I bet she looks like Fiona from Shrek, you know, after sundown. But you should call her over here because I don't want to have to go to Wow. <laughs> okay, yeah, Jeffy, you go get the girl. You hide behind the couch. Okay, I'll do that. <laughs> 
All right, now she's right there. So you're the girl who's causing all these problems. Look, I just want my money. <gasps> Have some dignity, young lady. I want my $45. $45? That's all she charged you? Hey, I worked hard for that. Yeah, I'm sure you did work hard with all that nasty stuff you did to Jeffy. How often do you do stuff like this? Do what? You know, bust your piggy open. That was my first time, and it was really embarrassing. I couldn't even show off my piggy for show and tell. You were going to show off your piggy for show and tell? Your father must be ashamed. I'm so glad we're trying to get rid of it. Get rid of what? You know, Will, will you get rid of it? Get rid of what? I just want my money. If we give you the forty-five dollars, will you do what we want? Um, yeah, sure. Okay, I'll give her the forty-five dollars. I got fifty. I got a hundred in my wallet. Okay, yeah, deal. All right, Brooklyn guy, you can come on out. She just wants money. <laughs> well, Marvin, I heard the whole thing. She sounds like a real gold digger. Oh, hey, Penelope, what are you doing here? Wait, Marvin, where'd the girl go? I want to show my daughter what a real slut looks like. Oh, uh, <laughs> she is the girl. <laughs> Penelope, you hussy! What? You're the girl who busted a piggy open? Yeah, I accidentally ran into Jeffy and he busted it open. Oh, this is a parent's worst nightmare. I thought I raised you better than that. And why are you charging money for it? Because he busted my piggy open! Oh, sweet Jesus. I shattered her piggy. You wanna f her, I'll kill you! <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny, it's not funny. We can't change what happened. It already happened. I guess you're right. It was an accident, right, Jeffy? Yeah. And I've had plenty of accidents, too. I mean, that's how Penelope was born. What? Listen, she said she'll get rid of it for $45. Wow. Get rid of what? Oh, you're getting rid of it, young lady. There's no way you're ready for that. What are you talking about? Oh, don't even try to hide it. Your stomach is huge. Oh, that? Yeah, I want to get rid of that. Oh, thank God. I was going to come to you for help as a doctor. Oh, good, because there's like there's some stairs over there, so I could just give you a knuckle sandwich right in the stomach. Um, isn't that going to make it worse? I mean, yeah, it's going to hurt, and it's not going to be fun, but then again, you already had your fun, didn't you? I didn't have fun with this. It was a really mean prank all the boys at school played on me. Everyone was in on it, and it hurt and stung. Oh, Bean Needle did. I'll kill you. <laughs> oh, that's no funny. Listen, she said she's willing to do a solution, so you just gotta find out which one she wants to do. Okay, yeah. Penelope, how do you want to get rid of it? I don't know. Like, a shot? Ooh, a shot. A shot. Yeah, that's, that's the best way of doing it. Um, I keep my shots over here, by the stairs. Okay. All right, Dad, where's the shot? Here's a shot. Right in the gut. <laughs> Okay, I think that might have done it. How's your stomach feel? It hurts, but it hurt before, too! Hmm, I think we need to go to the top of the stairs and do it a few more times. How is that gonna help my wasp sting? I'm sorry, you what? I got stung by a wasp on the stomach! Wait, 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 so you're telling me you didn't get pregnant? What? Ew, no, Dad! But, but what about your piggy getting busted open? I brought my piggy bangs for a show and tell and Jeffy knocked into me and it shattered on the floor! Oh, oh, thank God. Oh, I am so happy. What the hell did you think happened? No, no, nothing, nothing. Just keep your pure, innocent mind pure and innocent. Look, look, you just go home, and I will go upstairs and explain to those nice people what happened. Okay. Whew. Good news, everyone. Is it dead? Well, technically. <laughs> well, not even Chevy, because it turns out she wasn't pregnant to begin with. Oh, thank God. Woohoo! Well, uh, Game Strong is full. Well, no, not even that, because it turns out she and Jeffy didn't even do anything. But what about all the busting the piggy stuff? Oh, well, she brought her piggy bank to school for show and tell, and Jeffy just accidentally broke it. Then why was her stomach so big? Oh, uh, she got stung on the stomach by a wasp, and she's really allergic to wasps. That's why it swelled up so much. Well, Jeffy, why did you think you got her pregnant? Because I ran into her, and then everyone said she was pregnant. But that's not where babies come from. Yeah, this whole thing, let's just be happy that it was a big misunderstanding. Yup. Mm-hmm. Yup. Yeah, just a big misunderstanding. A big misunderstanding. Uh-uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go. Here's what you want. Man, yeah, finally. You're gonna take me to Disney World. <laughs> what is the worst thing that has ever happened to you? Hmm. I'm going to basic training. <laughs> That is. <sighs> I gotta take that. I gotta find right, my way bro. out through the wilderness. All right. Yeah. You know what's crazy? Like nothing but snow. Green. My mom always told me if I was to ever get kidnapped, they're gonna return to sender quick, and I was like, wow. And I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Yeah, they're, they're definitely sending you right now. <laughs> My girlfriend said the same thing. She said, oh yeah, they ain't gonna keep you for too long. Cause you gonna start asking me dumb shit. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be like, can we get some food? Like, why me? Like, an honor, why me? What makes me so special? They gonna think something wrong with me. Mm -hmm. But anyways, y'all. 
Um, it's been the one and only Bougie Marie. Hey, Bougie. If you guys have anything for us to react to, please, please put in the comments down below. Like, comment, subscribe, share, tell me your post notifications, and our social medias will be in the description down below. Yes, and we sir. all guys. Peace. Bye.